Good day everyone, I'm the Hat Hobbit and welcome to Gravitas. This is a game I found on Steam quite just randomly about a few weeks ago and I thought this would be a pretty cool game to play on the channel. As far as I know, it's sort of like a puzzle platformer sort of thing which you can control gravity. So that sounds like a really cool mechanic and I'm pretty excited to get into this. So let's just jump straight in. Space. Maybe that's us? I'm not really sure. Oh! Oh, we have control! Oh, nice! So, I suppose we could just go this way? Yes, that makes sense. I mean, I wasn't yes. intending on doing anything. Yes, we've arrived. Uh, my new pupil! Hello! Oh my goodness, you're so cute! Oh, thank you, you're really cute too! Face, so happy you could come! Mm. Hello! Uh, she, say hello to our new pupil! Hello to our new pupil! Hello, she! Thank you, she! Mm. So, who are you? Let's start over, shall we? Uh, uh, apologies if I seem out of sorts, it's been many a month since my last pupil died. It is an uh, egregiously what, what? large pleasure to meet you. My name is... Alright, the curator. Yes, yes, that makes the right body parts tingle. <laughs> but, uh, but enough about me. Let us begin your journey. Welcome, my new pupil, to the Gallery of Refined Gravity. Oh, very nice. She, you, you s silly girl. Remember how we rehearsed this? Engage the Gravitas Protocol. The what now? Engaging. Yes. Okay. Ah. Let's, uh... Uh, she, uh, open the lobby door, please. Lobby door, malfunctioning. Oh, fantastic. Still... <laughs> <laughs> Nothing is wrong. Let me just get this open. You... Hmm. Oh, <laughs> I mean, that's one way to do it. <laughs> this unique gallery Whoa. is an exploration into artistic expression using groundbreaking technology and cubes. Oh, nice. The only rule is no talking ever. Oh. All right? Good. No. She, the elevator. <laughs> Thank you very much. So I guess we just jump up here. Whoa! So to appreciate my revolutionary work here, Ooh, what's you will this? need this special glove. I call it the Ah! Uh, see if you are worthy and or have opposable thumbs. See, begin the connection sequence. Brilliant name for it. I love that name. Enhancement apparatus. Ding! Integration complete. Ding. Right, you should be ready. You now have. Very limited control over gravity. Oh, fantastic. Use that power. Come to me. Jump this petty gap, you glorious fool. Uh... What? No, no, you have to create a gravity field. Why would you just blindly... You know, it, it doesn't matter. Let's just get you out of there. <laughs> there is a fieldable surface on the ceiling, and you obviously need me to explain the controls. Yeah, we do. I have no now, idea what the controls are. directly into your spine. What? So, you can use the left side of your brain to create a gravity field. Focus, and it should just click. That's actually a really cool way of explaining controls. Now, when you do that, That's cool. the club emits energy that attempts to connect with these special glowy walls. The energy veins have nothing to do with anything. They are simply gorgeous. Are they? Uh, I mean, I somewhat don't believe you. You are ready. Yeah. Next, it's time for some art. Nice. Must move straight onwards then. Ever voice command? Whoa, what is that? That's pretty cool. Uh, I'm not really sure where to go. I'm just going to keep moving forwards, I think. Hello. Oh, good. There you are. Hello, creator. This is Gear the first piece of my gallery. Oh. I call this one Ascension. Ah, because it goes up. I see. Good name. Dramatic pause. <laughs> now that you have the idea, yeah, yeah, yeah. you have enough memory to store the significance of my work. And free Wi-Fi. Oh, very nice. Now off you go. Rise to a higher room 
of autistic thought. Yes, very nice. <laughs> oh, so in this first piece, I'm just going to observe you. All right. If you don't mind. Yeah, that's all for the future of the meeting. If you fine. So let's see. So we can jump. Let's begin. That's good. So I'm guessing we go maybe up there, but it doesn't look like we'd be able to reach up there. So we might as well explore the room a little bit. Maybe there's a way we can get up. Uh, I'm not really seeing anywhere yet. Hey, jump on the lamp. The lamp's not letting us jump up. So that takes us to there. Does, can I sneak up there? No, I can't. Oh, well. Uh... Hmm. There must be somewhere I can get up. Oh, maybe here? Yes, that looks right. There we go. All right, so then maybe we go across to there? I mean, that seems the, like, the most logical explanation for it. Like, because we can't go up here, so let's just jump across over here. Very nice. Okay, we're getting somewhere. Can I jump over here? I can, but it doesn't look like that's where I'm meant to go. So maybe we go over here. And then up here. Yes, this is all working very nicely. Jump over here. Then... What about now? Maybe over there? I mean, that would seem most logical. Hmm. I mean, this hasn't seemed to exactly work, so maybe there's a way to get over there? Oh, let, let's, let's go back over here, because maybe there's something I missed over here. That's actually really cool that you can oh, actually preview that, though. Discovering things after I tell you to. I call those special apparitions. Ghost fields. Ooh. Ooh. Right, let's press this, then. Aha! That looks like it'll come in handy. So, maybe if I do that, that bring the box over. Yes! So, I can jump up here. Then, come up here. Oh, you scaling that symbolism really fast. Wow, that took me four years to build, and you just... Mm. Hmm. Well, sorry for breaking your test. I, uh, I'm going up. This is actually really, really fun. I will now tell you a story. Oh, really? A story about a garden of gravity. Ooh. The garden is quiet. A gorg reminder. Press the right mouse button to cancel your current gravity <laughs> Right, so this looks like the garden that this dude is talking about. So maybe if we jump up here, we can actually get across to here. Um, all right. Yeah, we can get over here quite easily. Right, okay. So what do we need to do? I think we should probably jump down first and see what's over here. Because it looks like we need to get over this gap. But I doubt we're going to be able to go over that. So, maybe we need to get all the boxes and then take it from there. Alright, let's just bring these boxes over here. Uh, and those should be going into there. Falls into the river, bringing your goals uh, in sight by the disrupting box is stuck. Scaring deer and confusing the birds. This stone judges you. This second Great. stone stays neutral. It does not know you, but likes your face. The first stone judges this. Ah, I fell into the river. This because it is Secure. Right, let's just um go up here. Oh, well, but that's not what I wanted to do. No, boxes come back. Alright, let's just see. So we need to get that one unstuck, because I'm a doofus and got it stuck somehow. Um maybe if I jump on it a bit. I can remember. Um I will. We'll worry about that in a second. Uh, let's see if we can get this stone over. So nice. The first stone disturbs some fish. Does it? They jump out of the water for safety. 
and land on shore. Yeah. As they slowly die gasping, oh. they attempt to um. lament the irony. However, they cannot because they are fish. <laughs> After like 2.5 seconds, they forget they are dying. <laughs> <sighs> Alright, uh, so if we pull this one... Yeah, maybe. Because that grabs the block, so that moves over. And then I can grab it with this block one. And it goes into the water. Stone yes! breaks the surface of the calm pond of your mind, creating ripples that disturb the moss of your imagination. Alright, what am I going to do? The wavy imaginary moss distracts a deer who runs away. It's immediately the one tree. there. Which will start pulling these ones into position. Alright, looks like we need like one more. But I think we might be able to make that jump. But I kind of want to explore a little bit more. So let's sort of hop away up here. Alright. And then if we pull this one like so. Uh, we should be able to pull this over here, which allows us to pull it over to here. And we can cancel it so it falls into the, the river. Is a metaphor for distractions. <laughs> I can't begin to express how much I'm loving the humor in this game. Okay, so then we should just be able to jump across, right? The stones have now all drowned. Oh, fantastic. Hey, nice. So. Evacuating is now 42%. What do you mean? Is that a fish? It looks like a fish. See, there's the tail, there's the fin, and there's the head. That's pretty cool. It's a fish. <gasps> box. Cool box things. That's a whole, like... Is that like a whole office or something inside a little box? That's pretty cool. Alright, so on to the next puzzle. Ah, oh, little pupil friend! No. I have a surprise for you! Uh, I've added a few new things to this next piece to maximize your appreciation of my genius. Have I? What, what, what? what? I'm so excited. <clears throat> Welcome to the second piece of my gallery. I call this one, Now You Can Die! Ah. Uh... Alright, we'll go have some fun. And watch your step, if you like. Me. I don't like the look of this. I really don't like the look of this, but we might as well try anyway. Let's just make our way over Whee! here. Whee! <laughs> Oh, there you are. Ah. I'd like to introduce you to a friend of mine. This here is Bartholocule. Hello. He will be assisting you with this particular piece, which is good because he has neither skin nor eyes. Ah. Uh, be gentle with him, though. He's really sensitive. Ah, right. Yes, I understand. So let's just uh, pull Bartholocule over here. Uh, and then maybe drop me down. Well, Barfolla Cube, I'm going to keep you with me this entire time, so I'm just going to pull you over here, and pull you over here. You're a nice cube. Uh, let's just pull you up here, then, which should prevent you me from being sliced to death with these lasers. So, uh, where to go from here? Probably down, is my guess. Alert. Main generator coolant system malfunction. Um, I'm sorry, she repairs. has just been so Failure. desperate for attention lately. Just, just ignore her. For. I wonder. Pupil initiative. She, you will eventually <laughs> need to let that go. <laughs> the mastery of their abstract ice sculptures haunts me. Alright, so how would I do this properly? Maybe if I pulled this to here, then pull this over to this side. And then pulled you back over here to a distance. That seem, seems to have worked, but at the same time, uh, I need to be able to get over there without dying. This might be harder than I thought. Oh no! Oh no! Um, that probably wasn't the smart thing in the world. So if I do this and run. It doesn't do anything. Uh, Alert. Right, so. I honestly don't know. Uh, I mean, we could do this kind of slowly. Um, 
mastery of their abstract ice sculptures. Uh, well, that takes us to here, but I don't think that's going to be very helpful. Uh, put forward. Maybe you just do this slowly? Ah, uh, no, that was too fast, apparently. There must be a more sensible way of doing this. I'm just sort of doing this as slow as I can, just because it's probably the easiest way to do it, and even then it still doesn't work. So I have a feeling I'm doing this completely wrong. To be honest, it does seem like this is probably the main way of actually doing this, so I'm going to see if this is actually the way and see if I can do this. Hopefully without dying like I almost did there. This is actually pretty tricky. Ah, uh, there has to be a better way. Can I just ride on top of it? She has just been so desperate for attention lately. Just, just ignore her. I can just ride on top of it. All right, yeah, I can just ride on top of it. That's awesome. Uh, I don't want to leave you, my boat, my dude. I, I've forgotten your name already. I'm afraid. But fuck you, or thank you, it was or something. Uh, but do yourself well. We. You know what I just realized? I actually hate Bartholomew. What do you mean? Bartholomew oh, is amazing. Joy, we have arrived at uh, the laser ocean. To cross this perilous pool of peripheral pulchritude, you must truly understand uh -oh. why the mind fears death. But you also must fear death because if you fall in, you die. Ah, gotcha. Of course, reminder. <laughs> I'm loving the humor in this game. It is very much my kind of humor. I have a feeling that something is very wrong. <laughs> All right, well, it looks like we crossed the sea. So maybe if we bring you over here and bring this back over here, uh, if I can actually get the block. There we go. Uh, is the way I can pull this over here? There it is. Uh, I just want to check. Yeah, there's a hole there. So if we bring this block over here, we can probably jump down on here. Okay, let's bring it a little bit more. And we should just be able to go up, right? Whoa! Um. Oh, follow cube, no! Oh, and we should just be able to jump our way over here, right? Wow, we keep finishing these really fast. Do we? Oh, and you still have both of your eyes and feet. Yeah! Oh, well, this is an awesome game. I'm really loving this so far. So, maybe one more level, and we'll end the episode, because it might be getting a little bit long. I call this one surprise! Ah! Um... Quickly, appreciate my work while you're still high on adrenaline! Ah! Uh, ah! Uh, must use the eye, uh... Or, you know, uh, just uh, how rude of me. I got caught up in all the smashing. Did you? Let me introduce you to my special friend. Huh? I call her the Wreckahedron. I imagine this is the Wreckahedron. Hmm. So, uh, I imagine that we'll need to do something with you then. Uh, oh, I think I see. So if I pull this cube this way, oh sorry, the Rekahedron, we should be able to smash this, right? I'm I, I'm yeah. you and that. Much anger in you. Do you? And rightly so. Anger is the natural response to coexisting with stupid. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Let's just jump across here. Uh now where do I go? Oh, maybe I jump onto Yes, okay, and then I should just be able to jump over here. That's awesome, right. Welcome, my pupil, to your destructionist phase. I just now refine all the big glasses. Is it? Emergency thermal venting required. Please select a destination. 
Um, Fine. Fine. Let's let's just get this over with. To select me, love. Please say. Lobby is fine. Lob. No, my pupils need to survive. At least the first two galleries. To select gallery three. Please say. Uh, wow. That uh, that would have been awkward. Hmm. <laughs> All right, let's just smash this. All right, so we should be able to get through here, right? Maybe not. So maybe if we pull it back first and then do that. Yes. What? What? caught me off guard. <laughs> uh, you shouldn't be doing that, so let's just quickly just grab you a little bit. Oh, I see. So you need to be smashed. So let's just uh, pull you there. Actually, no, pull you over here first. Pull you there. And pull you over here. Which should be enough height to smash. Yes. Yeah, it's very nice. So we can pull you over here. And then we can pull you there. And hopefully... Not falling in the lasers like that. Uh. <laughs> that will never not be funny. <laughs> I should be able to jump this. Yes, there we go. Uh, well, I'm having a lot of fun with this, but I'm going to have to end that episode there because we have unfortunately run out of time. So we will join the creator again. I keep saying creator, it's not the creator, it's the curator. We will join the curator again in the next episode. But I'd like to thank you all for watching this episode of Gravitas. If you did enjoy, please hit that like button and leave a comment in the video below letting me know you want to see more. And if you're new around here, consider subscribing. I mean, it's completely free and honestly, you get to see more of me and more of this. This is actually a really fun game. Anyway, apart from that, I have one last thing to say. And that is, see ya, take care, and bye bye